Hi everybody, I'm going to help you learn how to do a virtual Sunday school class with something almost everybody has. We'll start first with a cell phone, like this, and, um, and if your Sunday school class does not have a cell phone, then we'll do it with a computer, though it's harder to do it with a computer and more frustrating. Um, let's go ahead, uh, a lot of people have Facebook. Um, and Facebook has an app, it has the little F symbol, but Facebook has many different apps that it owns, and so, um, and they do different things. The thing that you'll need uh, for doing a virtual Sunday school class to see your other Sunday school classmates will be Messenger. Messenger looks like um, a little uh, talking bubble that's blue with a, a white lightning bolt in it. In uh, Messenger, uh, it's kind of hard to see. Let's see here. There we go. You can see a list of your e emails, basically, in Facebook of all your friends. And you can have more than one people in it. Um, what you're going to do is, if you're the Sunday school teacher, you're going to uh, click in the upper right-hand corner where you can write a new email right there. And it says, uh, who's going to be in it? You can select. You can search. Um, who you're going to put in it. You can click, 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 click all of them. But most of these are your family and not a part of your Sunday school. So just type in all the names of the people that uh, you want to be in your class. I'm just going to pick my mom and my dad, pretending that they're in my Sunday school class because uh, they uh, hopefully won't respond at the moment. But if they do, it'll be a learning opportunity. So um, after I got my, my, my Sunday school class in there, that's just three people, I'm going to press done up here in the upper right hand corner. And, um, and oh, I've already have uh, some messages with some stuff in here. Some of that's personal, so I'll try not to, uh, to share it with you all. But down here, uh, or up in the upper right hand corner is a little camera with a green dot. Can you see that? Here, I'm adjusting the light. Little green dot. Uh, that means there are people on right now. When I press that, I'm actually getting a video of me um, in here. Here, I'll even show you. Um, hello, can you hear me? Ah, uh, your camera is your camera is off, but I can hear you. Why is my camera? Oh, here I see. There you are. There. Hi, Dad. That's the way it's supposed to work. Hey, Hi. you're on my. Uh, you're on. You're on film, learning how to do a Sunday school. So, this would be um, what you would see. The you would see yourself, and I'm recording with a different cell phone. And then you would see um, the person that you're talking to. Um, thanks, Dad. I'm gonna hang up with you and tell the rest of the video. Okay, Dad. All right, All right, thanks. Thank Bye. So now, from what I know, um, you can have up to um, six people in the video frame talking, I believe, but up to 50 people actually listening in. Whoever talks and whoever microphone is, is activated because of the sound, their video will pop up. So I think you'll have as many people as you want to in your Sunday school class participating. If somebody's noisy, you'll figure out who it is because the, their video will be popping up and one of you could suggest maybe putting their phone on mute so that we can hear the rest of the Sunday school class going on. If people do not have a cell phone, um, I can show you a little video of how to get things done on um, a laptop. Um, but that is a little bit more complicated because you have to have a, a laptop or a computer. Have You'll have to have um, a camera, a microphone, and some way to hear, like speakers or earbuds. So all of that put together um, is more complicated for some people, and that's why I recommend a cell phone. Hey guys, uh, this is how you make a um, virtual class with Facebook. Now we are on my homepage, which is just... Um, all my friends and all their other stuff. Um, but if you go into Messenger over here, you'll see all the emails or uh, Facebook emails that I've gotten from friends. I'm going to go ahead and just create a new group. 
when I do that, um, it's going to say, what do you want to name the group? And I'm just going to call it Virtual Sunday School. When you do that, you can add the people that you want. I'm just going to add in my family because they know what's coming. Uh, there's my dad and my mom and my sister. Okay, we'll just pretend that my Sunday School class only has three people in it. These are the only people that know what's going on when I'm making this video. So here is this here. What you can do is, uh, if it doesn't have a uh, these three logos, there's the camera, the phone, and the options here. The camera is what you're actually going to do when you're trying to talk with people. This is this talk with people over video. So if your computer has a camera and a microphone already hooked into it, that's perfect. If your computer does not have a camera, they will not see you. <clears throat> if your computer does not have a microphone, they will not be able to hear you. Oh look! He's typing something in. Test, test, this is me. Um, so my dad is actually typing something in. Would you like to video chat? And then this is uh, what you do. You click on this, and that's everybody that's in here. And I'm going to press call. It's going to open up this window because it's looking for people. Let's see, it's loading right here. And this is me. Oh, hey! This is me. Hello. And there's my dad. Hi, dad. I can't hear you because I'm actually recording the screen right now. You're going to be on the video on how to do Sunday school videos. All right, I'm going to say goodbye. Bye. So that's one thing we need to keep in mind. The problem is all of the people that are joining need to have a microphone and a, and a camera. You're not going to be able to hear each other very well, and it's going to be pretty frustrating. So I actually recommend having um, uh, doing it through a cell phone so um, if you do have people in your Sunday school group that want to join you make sure that they all have a camera a microphone and somehow to hear you so uh, ear, ear, earbuds or a speaker on their device okay thank you so much goodbye